Well, we're going to start. It's already. Uh, Chairman Urusumal talk too much, you just mute him. <laughs> well, I, I wish I remotely due to the circumstances caused by the COVID-19 to hoarder. May we all bow our heads for a moment of silent prayer. Okay, Chief Clerk, roll Senator Aritos. Senator Christian. Senator Figueroa. Yeah. Senator Goland. Senator Goland. Floor Leader Harper. Yes. Senator Conman. Can I hear any of the troop delegations? Vice Speaker Moses. Hey, Amen. Senator Ned. Hey, Amen. Senator Palik. Present. Senator Perman. Hey, Amen. Senator Romulo. Senator Romulo. Senator Rusmal. Hello, Senator. Senator Wally. Speaker Simina. Yes. Mr. Speaker, 12 members are present. We have a quorum to transact business uh, this morning. The next item is appointment of the committee to wait on the president. And because of these uh, unique circumstances that we find ourselves in, I will, without objection, appoint members of the Pond Bay delegation, since they're present in uh, Pond Bay, to serve as members of our committee to wait on the president. And that will be chaired by uh, Vice Speaker Moses. Uh, Vice Speaker Moses, uh, consult with the president and uh, as to a time and place when you can have the meeting with him and his uh, cabinet. Okay. So, any point of privilege, uh, Vice Speaker Moses? Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I defer to Chairman of the Pompey Delegation. <laughs> Okay, uh, it's been uh, yielded to you, uh, German Berman. Point of yeah, privilege. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, good morning, Mr. Speaker, uh, all honorable members. My utmost respect to His, Ex His Excellency Panuelo, the honorable the Vice President George, and their cabinet members that is also joining us this morning, 
on all of those that is also observing our session this morning. I believe we don't have the diplomatic corps here with us this morning. So good morning, staffs and everybody. Mr. Speaker, um, um, let, uh, motion to stand in recess till one o'clock this afternoon. Short recess, subject to call of the chair. Congress is back in session. Uh, we still have the floor, Chairman. Uh, yeah, Burnham. thank you, Mr. Speaker. So, like I said, uh, we mentioned all the needed people need to be on record this morning. So, for that, I would throw the motion that's been said previous. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. So move. Uh, there is no objection. Uh, the motion to resist uh, by Chairman Perman is withdrawn. Uh, continue on uh, point of privilege, uh, acknowledging our Officials. Point of privilege, Mr. Speaker. The state your point uh, for Leader Harbor. Thank you, uh, Mr. Speaker, and good morning to you all, honorable members. Yeah, I'd like to follow suit uh, by uh, also extending my greeting of respect to His Excellency uh, Panuelo and uh, Honorable Vice President George and all those officials who are present in that. Uh, room there or chamber there. Uh, my greeting of uh, happy Easter to all of them. And I hope they're all doing good uh, during this time. In addition to that, I'd like to uh, introduce or recognize the presence of our Consul General in my room, uh, Her Excellency uh, Teresa Philippe. So may I ask that we give all those people down in Pond Bay and uh, Teresa a big round of applause, please. Okay. Uh, thank you, uh, Floor Leader Harper, for introducing uh, ours, especially I join you on behalf of Congress in 
uh, acknowledging and uh, recognizing uh, our Excellency President Banuelo and uh, the Honorable uh, uh, Vice President uh, George, and of course, Consul General uh, Philippine, and all those staff, whether uh, they're uh, cabinet members or just staff of uh, uh, President's office, uh, we also want to acknowledge their presence. And uh, thank you very much for that. Okay, Jeff, next item. Uh, Mr. Speaker, item number five, presidential communications. We're in receipt of numbers 200 or 21 237 through 21 261. Okay, assign those, uh, Chief Clerk. Uh, uh, take note, uh, members, especially the chairmen of uh, those specific items relating to the uh, uh, COVID-19. Uh, see what your plans would be on that since we have only five days of uh, session. Okay, next item, Chief Clerk. Mr. Speaker, item six, FSM Supreme Court Communications in receipt of number 21-11. Sign that, Chief Clerk. Next item. Item seven, member communication. We have uh, number 21-12. Sign that, Chief Clerk. Next item. Item eight, departmental communications. So in receipt of numbers 21-55 through 21-57. Okay, uh, sign those, uh, Jeffrey. Uh, take note of some of those uh, important communications, uh, specifically from uh, the uh, Secretary of Finance. Next item. This is Speaker Item 9, Agency or Governmental Authority Communications, when receipt of numbers 21 43 through 21 53. Okay, assign those to uh, Next item. Yeah. Mr. Speaker, item 10, state communications. We're in receipt of two communications and their numbers 21-19 and 21-20. Okay, so assign those to Perk. Next item. Item 11, state Supreme Court communications. There are none, Mr. Speaker. Okay, next item. Item 12, municipal or town communications, also none. Next. Item 13, foreign government communications, none, Mr. Speaker. Okay, order of the day. Short recess, subject to call the chair. Okay. Right. Congress is back in session. We are on the order of the day. Uh, Vice Speaker Moses, you have any point? <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I have uh, consulted with the president and uh, he has agreed that we meet right after today's session. And so I believe that would give us time uh, to prepare the report uh, for a split session this afternoon, probably around three. So I so move that we stand in recess until three o'clock this afternoon, Second. Sunday time and two o'clock Chuk time. Second. I guess I should have uh, 
mention hey. two o'clock chook time first because speaker's time is session time. So two yes. o'clock chook time. It, it should be always speaker's time, but you're still okay. We understand everything. So it's been moved and seconded that Congress uh, uh, stand in recess for a split session until two o'clock troop time and three o'clock uh, bond bay time. Those in favor of that motion say yes. Oh, motion? Yes. yes. Motion carried. Congress now stands in recess until uh, two o'clock uh, troop time this afternoon. Yeah.